welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooptopia Shigo Island map. I hope you're having a good day. hope I'm going to have a good day, and I hope you enjoy the episode. All right, let's have a quick look. I, as you can see, if we get a little higher, I have started marking out the planned base expansion. It went before committee. We discussed it. And this is, I think about it um, I need to make a whole load of walls I'm not sure if this is the final the final final but this is uh, I always call it stage two but as I said I'm struggling I'm struggling without a dodic uh, I just just can't well I can but it's just going to take forever and a day to gather the stone I need to make the walls so I am even more so on the lookout for a, a decent level dodic. I'm hoping I don't have to settle. But from what I've seen, that may just have to be the case. I think this is a level 80. I think. Yep, it's a miracle it's still alive. It keeps getting attacked. It keeps getting attacked. And what's having a go over there? Are they raptors having a go? So there's a the little dodie there. Oh, that's another 80. That's a male. What's going on over here? It's a, oh, it's a sabre. That's a male, and... That's a female. Hmm. So that's an interesting possibility. There's another Ken There's a Kentrosaurus down there. Um... What's that sabre? 140 sabre. And it's a male. And I think one I've got some male as well. Um, hmm. That is an interesting possibility. Yeah. I was gathering some metal up here. And if we go up here, I'll show you why I'm bringing you up here because of the latest patch uh, quite a few things have changed and we've had obviously some new dinos added um, I, I didn't really know where to look for them uh, the big the big the dead ones the piggies the big pigs um, I say I was gathering some metal up here and I was hoping to bump into another Ovis. You never know your luck. But what I did bump into, if they're around now, what are you? Are you around here? Oh dear, dear. Um, well, now I say that, I did bump into some of the, the Deodons, the pigs. Are you another female? Megaceros. So anyway, <laughs> I was hoping to show you some Deodons, but uh, they appear to not be here. I mean, I'm sure they're around somewhere. So should I want these? Is that a... Should I want... No, oh, it's a, it's a, it's a rhinos, rhinos a pig. Different type of pig. But um, should I want to, or when I want to get around to taming a Deodon, they are around here, or rather they were around here. So that's that. But I do need, I do, sorry, I'm, I'm trying to think and talk at the same time. And it's, uh, and for those of you who have watched me for a while, you'll know that's, that's, hello? Oh, that's a Palovia. To know that I'm not terribly good at thinking and talking at the same time. Where you gone? Where you gone, Palovia? There you were. Level 20, new. Well, I'm going to carry on doing this. Um, when I find some piggies, I'll bring you in just to show you where they are. Um, but in the meantime, I'm going to... I've, I've got to go looking. I probably shouldn't have said I was looking for a dodic. Because if Ark's listening, which it invariably is, it's going to hide them all from me. Right then. BRB. Well, well, that was quick. I was just out grabbing some narco berries and uh, the wall's up and running. There you go. 
Um, let's do a quick um, change name. Um, blah, 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 blah. 209. Fido. <laughs> Very unimaginative, but whatever. Um, I need a demo gun. Do you come with me, Sam? Stand there. Let's have a quick look at your statistical. So we've got 2706 HP, uh, 1118 stamina, uh, 238 weight, and 341 melee, which is cool. Um, I'm sort of planning on using, possibly testing him out in the cave behind the base. Right, I'm going to get a demo gun, get this chap out of here, and I'm going to sit him alongside the saber to do a bit of passive leveling before I go and try and get it killed. Right, uh, there we go. And then I, I'm still, I'm still trying to build up uh, supplies of oil, so as I can get some um, gasoline made, so I can actually get a generator online. Cool, uh, but this this thing's doing an absolute sterling job. I need to I need to get a generator online, so as I can have fridges and so on and so forth. Um, but at the moment, with the oil shortage, <laughs> um, it's not it's not that easy. Um, yeah, demo gun. Right, you need to go in there, my man. You need to go in. Right, there we go. Let's have you out. Right. And there's another. I just killed an RG that was hanging around the base, and there's another one there. Um, yeah, let's put you away. Come with me, Fido, if you will. And you can sit there, I guess. It's as good a place as any till I get a bit more organised. Right, what are we going to do? I think the first thing to do is get the health up. So it's a 2706. And what did you get? Come on, calculate. There we go. Oh, my lord. It's about 1300 health, 1400 health, something like that, 1300? About 30, that's, uh, that's not bad at all, this fellow will have a, a decent health pool before long. Right, well, let's uh, put this back together again. And go and dump the demo gun. And I think we'll go and have a look at that RG that's loitering around. May have to get rid of that. Well, we will have to get rid of that. Where you is? There you is. Uh, can I see you through this somewhat ridiculous spyglass? There we go. Level five. Yeah. Um, yeah. Got to go. Even though it's a level five, it can do quite a bit of damage if it gets into the base. Actually, I've put them all on passive, haven't I? I have to take them off that. Right, chap. You got to go. And bang, bang, you're gone. Oh, well, well, well. Sometimes you end up looking for one thing and you find another. That's exactly what I've been after as far as Argies go. All the Argies I've got are chaps, and this one's a lady, and it's a 150, no less. I've had to drag her quite away. We're actually from the other side, the um, other side of the mountain, but I'd rather do that than risk knocking her out in the wild. It's just just way too risky. And I eventually get a chance to show you how this little trap of mine works. I say I don't think I invented it. I, it's far too clever for me. But it works, and I've used it very effectively quite a few times. Right, off. Get the pillar out. And there we go, and it's mine. She is now safe. Well as far as this area goes. So all I need to do now is knock her out. Bonk. And she's not going anywhere. Oops. What? Oh, I put the pillar in the wrong place. Ugh. So much for that. Right, let's go and get her back. Where's she gone? There she is. Are you still? Yes, you're going to aggro on me. Good. Oops. Wow, that was... 
That was me showing off and not doing it properly, getting a little bit too excited. Now is she in? She's in. Land off. Get her out. Right, let's do it properly. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Yep, she's not going anywhere this time. Pillar's in the right place. Okay, now we can go about the uh, night night. Oh, that was 117 right in the face. We're not doing that again. Well, this is a good one. I never expected. And I did see some Deodon on the way back when I was dragging her, but I was a little bit busy, so I didn't record anything. Now, hopefully, it shouldn't take too much to knock her out. And because I'm using darts, there's very little chance of her dying. Unless some stupid creature comes and decides to... Uh, have a nibble, but that's not going to happen because I'm going to get the Rex out here as soon as I can. I'm going to put the, uh, the Tranodon away and get the Rex. Let's see if I can get her to go across that way. I don't really want her in this corner. Yep. Now what are we going to call you? I know that's a bit previous, but I think I might resurrect one of my favourite names for Argies, for the Lady Argies. Ooh, and I missed. Yeah, see, she's not happy. She'd be gone by now. I'd be chasing her all over the map, and they don't aggro on you once their torpor gets high, and... No, I'm having nothing to do with this... What I regard as a silly runaway mechanic. And there she goes. Oh, yes. It's exactly what I wanted. Right, let's put that away. Right, let's go and put you in there. I don't think there's anything too bad around. There was a couple of Kentrosaurus hanging around, but um, I ate those. Whew! Well. Well, well, well. Look for one and get another. Now, with me here, nothing's going to spawn in the area. It may wander in or fall down off there, which quite a few things do fall down off there. Um, my ichthy's over there. Still floating. I don't know what to do about that. I really don't. Oh, well, whatever. He seems happy enough and nothing's bit him, so he uh, seems safe enough. Right then, let's have a quick look at her base stats. It doesn't really mean a great deal, but it, it sort of cheers me up. Um, we got 2482 health, 980 stamina, 600 weight, 210 melee. I can't really infer anything from that. Hopefully they'll go up. The health may be 50%, the stamina may be 50%, the weight may be 120 maybe. A melee might go up to around about the 300, maybe. Right then, I'm going to sit, uh, sit here, well stand here, keep her company, keep an eye on what's going on, and I'll bring you back when she tames up, so we are the yeah, yeah. So hopefully, hopefully any second now, she, there we go, brilliant. And she's 224, she's a perfect level. Despite being prime tame, courtesy of our uh, taming rates, she's a perfect level. Absolutely brilliant. Let's have a quick look at the stats. Now, as I thought, the health did go up by about 50%, so did the stamina. Actually, I think the, stam no, the stamina was about 50%. The weight, mm, not so much. And the melee, yeah. It's about, it's, it's about what I expected. Well, that doesn't matter. She's exactly what I was after. Right, young lady, you need to... Um, Come out here, I guess. So we pick you up. And come on. There you go. Lovely. Now let's put the pillar back. There. Whew. Right now, let's get her back in and uh, get a saddle on her. So I have... So, oh, are we going to get stuck? Nope. I have kind of plans for her. I think um, at some stage I may well... Be. Unless I can find a 150 male. Oops, no. There, we're stuck. 
Nope. Um, oh, hell. Oh, well, whatever. <laughs> Turning into a bit of a mess. Let's go through the front door. Now, I think she's going to sit on the roof for a bit. So I don't want to do anything silly with her and lose her. Right, unfollow. And there you go. Now, I need to be looking for something else. But I won't say what. BRB. As promised, there's the piggies. Unfortunately, as you can see, they're rather low level. So I shan't bother with these chaps. But I'm going to keep an eye out for them. And I shall, shall be looking. Oh, aggressive little devils. Because they're very, very useful with that healing buff. Right then, I'm going to carry on doing what I'm doing. They <laughs> are cool. Right then, see you in a bit. Remember me saying I was going to go with the mammoth over a beaver? Well, I was just scouting out the, uh, the swamp there. And I saw this chap, and as you can see, it's a level 135, and I really couldn't ignore it. Um, I do feel as if I've kind of let myself down. But it's, it, I just couldn't ignore the level. I just really couldn't. Um, yeah. <laughs> And I've just been attacked by a micro raptor. I was flying a little bit too close to the ground, and the little devil came up and knocked me off my bird. But hey ho! Right, I'm gonna. I'll see you back at base. Yeah, he's in the trap. Well, pen thing. Right then, how many darts do I have? Seventy-one. And my gun's gonna need repairing very shortly. So I'm gonna go ahead and knock this. Okay. Yeah, I had, uh, when the Microraptor attacked me, I quickly hit J before I passed out. So the bird would follow me and defend me. Right then, take that. And that. Ah, there we go. Yeah, in the nose. Load, if you wouldn't mind. There we go. Right, what are we going to call you? Hmm. And you've got nowhere to run, my little friend. I was also while I was over the swamp. I mean, I think, I think the, more, more, the more I look at this area, um, the more I learn about this area, the more sure I become that I chose well as far as where my base goes. Because behind me, as you can see, obviously, I've got the mountain with um, all the resources that offers, uh, not just in sort of the mineral wise. Oh, and you're out. You are out, my little friend. And I hope I didn't shoot him after it had gone down. But yeah, um, not just mineral-wise, uh, but also taming-wise, the, the variety of animals up there. And then on the other side, I have the swamp over there, I think it is, and the redwood over there. So they too, they offer quite a lot of resources. And this is going to be a berry tame, isn't it? It's going to be a wolf. Oh, that poo disappeared. So yeah, the more I know about the place, the, uh, the happier I am with it. Um, I won't put you through this. This is going to take a long time. And if we have a quick look at his stats, it, it, it's only representative of what he'll end up being. Um, about as you can see, I, I did hit a, a couple of beaver dams, which is kind of nice. And I've also found another source of fairly easily available uh, silica pearls rather than going over and pooching someone else's. Um, but, what was I going to say? Oh, I don't know, I don't know. Well, I'll see you back, BRB. And any second now, hopefully, uh, there we go. Cool. Uh, let's have a quick look at your stats. Uh, 3,300 
health, uh, 702 stamina, uh, weights 468, 276 melee, 170% movement speed. It's not, not a bad little chap, not a bad little chap. The Q. And yeah, as I said, I, I kind of feel like I've let myself down a bit by going for um, the beaver. But sometimes, well, you know, he was there. Uh, let's, uh, let's do this 201. I won't name him just yet. Uh, we probably need to have you on a new trail. But there are plenty of things that the mammoth can do, or rather that I can use the mammoth for, that the beaver could do, but the mammoth's got more chance of getting there and back alive. Namely getting some um, rare flowers and rare mushrooms over in the swamp. Uh, the beaver can do that perfectly adequately, but it's the journey to and there that's the problem. When I was looking around over there, there's a lot of bad things, a lot, a lot of bad things on the way. Well, let's have those out. You don't want to eat those things. Put them in there. Jolly good. How are we doing for meat? Berries. Perfect. So, uh, we have the beaver and the mammoth for getting for gathering wood so that just puts even more sort of emphasis on my, my, my need for a dodic um, I'm just going to have to keep looking just going to have to keep looking but in the meantime I'm going to go and gather some more wood with the, uh, with the mammoth just hopefully get a couple more levels on it uh, to get it not sure, not sure. It's melee's at 1100 and his health's at uh, 6600. I'd be happier if his health was around about 10,000 and his melee was as high as I could get it reasonably. I mean, it's only had, um, what, 15 levels? Yeah, 15 levels. But on it so far, so there's still plenty of wiggle room on this fella. It is a fella. You a fella? Yeah, Miracle Max. So I'm going to carry on with that. Um, other plans for the day? Obviously, I'm going to just—I'm just going to have to uh, bite the bullet and keep looking for a decent level dodig. So there were those two level 80s over there, and like I said before, I—I I don't want to settle, but if I have to, I have to. With the stack mod, um, the weight's not going to be that much of an issue. Um, normally, so I'm vanilla or, or whatever, if I wasn't using a stack mod, then a level 80 dodic, um, the weight would be an issue. Um, but it won't be. So, I mean, I may have to just bite the bullet and go with it. But I'm going to carry on doing this, and I shall bring you back in due course. So, maybe. Well, would you look at that? I went looking for the piggies and they've actually come down to see me. Now they represent a threat. Because they've just demolished a level 75. Haha, <laughs> too late. Level 75 mammoth with ease. So they have to go. We don't want piggies down here. What else was over here? I think it was an RG. Well, as you can see, I've started putting the walls up. Uh, I'm just about to put the remainder of the walls I have up and then start demolishing these to help finish it. Right, let's just go and you stay there, kiddo. You stay there. I'm going to go and grab the walls off my mammoth. Yep, who's quite hurt because I've been levelling him up. He's got well, at 10,000 health, that was really easy. So uh, he might get more. Right, let's see how much, how far I can get with these. And then we have, oh, that wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Fortunately, I did it here in the base and not out <coughs> in the wild. <laughs> 
and there yeah there's another gap in the wall there um and this is this is this is the compound in its maybe finished form i'm not sure yet um <laughs> okay what level are you rg let's have a look at you where are you there you is you're level 10 you can go away now the next thing next thing thing is um a dino barn i'm thinking along one of the straight i could i could i suppose actually just build it straight i don't know if i get the uh, foundations in it's a bit of an odd shape um but it's worth a thought maybe along here because I can use those funny angles for um, ancillary buildings just um, uh, breeding breeding pen maybe hatchery that sort of thing a large dino storage well not so much storage as in lining them up actually thinking about it this this might be a good place for it yes I think I think I think that's what I might do um, so that will be the next one um, again it just raises the uh, the need for a dodic I know I'm going on about it but it is it's a bit of a thing now so I think I'm going to take I just leveled I just leveled this young lady up three levels into health 10,000 health she is awful roughed up though and she's laid an egg as well oh we didn't want to do that either i'm having a problem with buttons keys even right pick up um yeah i think i'll stick with the um the usual way i seem to do things which is the first two floors will be uh, the first two layers will be of stone and the next two or, or whatever oh no they're gonna have to be high because we're gonna have some fairly high dinos in there aren't we however that's 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 for uh, another occasion i need to get stone and make some foundations so um i think i think i think that's where i'm gonna leave it for the time being um yeah i'll see how much more i can get done with what time i have left so yeah uh, you know how it goes we are we I'm afraid as far as dodix go I'm going to have to make do. Um, I've, I've looked, I've spent way too much time looking for a dodix so um, there's this little lev level 80 it's come out of its shell after being harassed and harangued insensible ooh alright that's that's not good by uh, a bunch of um, allosaurs so I think we're just going to drag him down here, get him in the pen. Knock it out, he says. Ow. And then just make do. Come on, we. There you go. I mean, I could just knock it out around the base, but it's been too many horrible things hanging around just lately so I'd rather have it in the pen inside the compound it'll be a lot safer in there and uh, it will of course or she it will at some stage run away and as I stated before I'm having none of that yeah. so I'd rather not shoot it too many times out here just enough to get it back because I don't want it to start running away out here come on oh dear tell you what let's get the Rex in a, a reasonably safe position now let's do it this way bonk going to 
say, I wonder what was going on then. Come on. Come on, little fella. been a bit unnecessary but whatever <clears throat> hopefully now I won't need to shoot him again outside the pen he should oh okay having said that determined to make me work for this, aren't you? Up you come. Missed. Ha ha. Ooh, I'm stuck. That's not good. He's glitched and I'm stuck. Am I unstuck? No, I'm stuck. Are you going to knock me off? Yep, bless you. Well, that's weird. That was a glitch that wasn't there before for some reason. Uh, hopefully, this little fella will drop in like that. And then we can just do as normal. Are you going to get me? Possibly. In the nose. Are you running? I think you're running. What we don't want is we don't want it to ball up. It won't. I can still knock it out when it's balled up. But I'd rather not. But it is hurt because I say it's been chewed on by the uh, the aloes that were up there. Come on, you're just making it hard work now. And there we go. Right, so, all things being equal, I now have a Dodi that should turn out to about 119. Um, I think I'm going to leave it there. You'll join me next time with my new Dodi, and the mouse is moving. So, for me and all the little, little beasties here, I wish you a very good day. I, I hope you enjoyed the episode. Till next time, bye!